What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Socks, and welcome to the channel, y'all. If it's your first time here, be sure to hit that subscribe button, the notification bell, the like, the everything. If you guys read the title, you already know what is going on. Today, we're going to be linking up with the boy, Linking Komape, and we're just gonna be doing a day in the life. But anyway, guys, there's something I actually wanted to touch on. I've been noticing like a lot of comments that have been saying that um that they they want me to go back to making content like the old type of content that i used to make you know like the more entertaining stuff and the, the pranks and what wada 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 you know but i just wanted to explain that like guys me as a person and the channel overall have kind of like grown from that you know i feel like for me i have a purpose to fulfill and the purpose is basically what i'm doing right now you know I feel like I'm in alignment with what I'm supposed to be doing and there's a bigger goal and a bigger mission you know and I know this content that I make is not for everyone you know and that's completely okay like I wouldn't blame me if you stopped watching because it's not for you because well, well it's not for everyone but it's just the thing of like I feel like we've or I've gotten to a point where I want to make content that actually means something you know content that actually empowers the youth empowers people in general motivates and inspires you know and the best way that i know how to do that is through documenting the lives of individuals that have reached a certain level of success you know documenting the lives of people that are actually doing something with their lives at such a young age you know and the main reason why I'm choosing the individuals that I'm choosing is because I've seen how they live, you know? And because it's so inspiring to me and because of the influence that they have on people in general, just like, you know what? Let's actually give people a little glimpse into your life, a little glimpse into your story, just to show them that it's actually possible, you know? What's good, my nigga? I'm already on spam. <laughs> Share some spam there. Advertise. What's yeah. up? What's up? What's up? What's, what's up, up, my nigga? What's up, guys? Hopefully, you guys are not. It's a chilled morning. I don't know how I didn't struggle to wake up. And this boy right here, you struggling, eh? Yeah, I'm struggling hard, you. Yeah, like, I was struggling, struggling so guys, hard. But we're here. Today's gonna be a long day. I already think that we're late because, yo, it's half past eight and we have to get our first lesson at 10 o'clock. And it's a mother and a father, so I'm quite nervous. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Let's go and see what the day has for us. Where we're going now, it's actually crazy because it's actually like a father and a son. How do you feel about that, actually? I, bro, I don't know, bro. Like, I feel so, like, what? Going on. But like, first is that guy, the son who recommended, who recommended me, right? Yeah. So, but for himself, like he was like, uh, Dad, please, I wanna learn how to do forex because the guy doesn't know forex, but he knows me in general. Oh, okay. okay. I wanna know how to learn forex and drop shipping, but I wanna start with forex, blah blah blah. And then the dad is paying, right? Because this guy's in high school, this one is in high school. Yeah. And then after a conversation with me the uh, the dad had a like conversation with me he wanted to pay for the son but then after i think he liked my personality or something because that bro was like hey all right i also want to add that <laughs> <laughs> when last did you do a one-on-one -on -one, actually bro actually i have the last time i did a one-on-one -on -one was actually like last year yeah. but that was because my admin was so poked or like it was so packed like yeah, yeah i couldn't yeah. I couldn't, like, I couldn't, like, plus I had no admin ladies at the time, so now I have admin ladies, okay. so it could help me out, so I didn't want to do one-on-ones whereby my admin was packed, yeah, 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 yeah. and stuff like that, yeah. so now that I'm up to date, that's why I got back to one on one so now I'm fully back, but I'm going to do seminars, you know, most I'm going, like, yeah, 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 going yeah. to every province in, the, in Africa this year, so also that I'm going to push it a bit, but for now, one on ones are back. Last time I did it was last year, I caught it. But yeah. I can't. Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. now the people want to know about the alpha markets team, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. What yeah. made you steer towards that, bro? Obviously, it said it was a great opportunity for you. But tell us more about it. Yeah, bro. You know, like, everyone has, like, uh, an opportunity, bro. And yeah. the opportunity you get now. Uh, surely in the next few years you'll get 
an even bigger one, you know, that's yeah. how God works. Like, yeah. You can't be stuck in the same place forever. Yeah, yeah. Even people like our legends, Messi and Ronaldo, yeah, true, like, true, yeah. they even made the move. So you can't play in the same team, like, forever. Well, you can, but the opportunities are out there and there's much bigger opportunities each and every time that God will bring to you. You just have to pick. Yeah. So in terms of, like, my move, I saw that, like, it supports my lifestyle first. And yeah. Then, uh, Alpha Markets like supports my lifestyle because I'm always on the road doing seminars and they believe in helping people, right? Uh, especially on the streets. Um, yeah. That's why we have things like free seminars, right? Yeah. And these yeah. seminars, it's not like other, not to shit on any companies or anything, but these free seminars, also what I like about them, like I said, they provide lifestyle, bro. We don't like come there formally teaching you Forex, like that seminar comes like along with like MT performing and like, oh, yeah. free luxury free luxury food. So you get to taste like not only do you get to learn uh forex but you actually get to taste like the yeah, benefits the of what it. Comes, yeah, you see what, what comes, comes after yeah. it. So that's what we provide like for free. So alpha like like it sees my vision, that's also where I wanna see myself grow. Um but still like in terms of my movement Ah, it's nothing personal bro, it's just business. Yeah. I just feel like for my students and for my clients, I prefer Alpha Markets because like the from the platform that I know my students, obviously everybody knows their students and clients or whatever. Yeah. So if I recommend something to them, it's for a reason. So that's why I made the shift. I felt like it's an important shift that I have to make in my life. Yeah. Let me just take it and see what it has for me. No, real man. Real. I bet guys, so we just touched down McDonald's because Lincoln is like an hour early to his lesson. So he's just gonna grab something to eat. I bet guys, so right now we're just waiting for the food. You know what I mean? This guy came eating scones. <laughs> so obviously he's full. <laughs> Literally, I had like two scones and I'm like chilling. But my boy sponsored me with an iced latte. Shout out. Yeah. yeah. Which I don't get, but okay. What do you mean you don't get? Why do you drink iced coffee? Like it's coffee for a reason. Nah, dude, it's perfect. Like it's perfect, bro. That's like putting boiled like water into like cold drink. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm dead, man. But uh, let's get into the nitty gritty, bro. Obviously, like some people obviously started following you like a bit later, like when you obviously reached a certain level of success. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So tell us about like the before, bro. Like, um, just like briefly about your story, because I watched your interviews. Yeah, yeah, yeah. About yeah. how, yeah, everything started, but a lot of people happened. You know? yeah, so don't you yeah. like, yeah, yeah. So to it. sum it up, like, um, Lincoln Komape have always been known for that. Yeah. But as per, but I've been known for like drop shipping, right? Yeah. So that's basically like reselling of products and stuff like that. So I had like a small like I've always been like getting my own money in terms of like business wise and everything. Yeah. But in terms of like popularity, I would say I was not that well known. I was just known again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah like uh, after I started like venturing into new business like which is um, forex trading I decided to kill both of them, like basically do all of them. So I think people liked, or I got more client. Okay, I got more people looking at me in terms of like forex traders. I guess it's because I started hanging out with forex uh, traders, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Bandi, their maps at them, right? Yeah. So I think hanging out with them, and not to say that like I was hanging out with them because we were friends, but eventually yeah. like it just took a like. A backlog and it just came to me that you know what like let me also try forex yeah, yeah so yeah, i started yeah, it yeah. and eventually it worked out so i got a huge fan base from that as well and i think people are liking it because i do like both of them you see so yeah. i'm sure that like everything is it's like, possible basically yeah. yeah that's actually crazy man because yeah. a lot of people limit themselves even when it comes to one thing but yeah. you like chose to master both of them. Yeah, both of them. Yeah, yeah no, nah, that's so yeah. cool. So, um, with your dropshipping journey, like, um, how do you get to the point of mastering it? Like, how did you get to that point of like actually making it work and saying that like I'm not gonna stop until? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now for me, it's hard, bro. Because remember, me and my my mom, uh, <clears throat> first she was a single mom, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Yeah, yeah. 
we grew up like her name so basically she has been reselling on the streets you know, oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah so yeah, yeah. i feel like i got that knowledge there because she's the one who even showed me suppliers and everything like that yeah, and then crazy. like in terms of like losing it i don't know i don't think i'll lose it it's in my jeans bro so yeah i'll ever find ways of like maybe advancing it the way i'm doing maybe yeah. like one day i wanna like not even take a look at my stores and just know that like they, they're I'm already making money, money yeah. yeah so like i don't think i'm gonna stop anytime soon i'm just gonna like maybe keep on advancing yeah because the job shipping doesn't really take you home there yeah, so that's no, the that's beneficial true. factor so in terms of stopping then nah, i don't think i think that's the urge i think it's because of because it's in my jeans that's why that's what will never make me stop not real man yeah hey i don't wanna make it an interview interview that's yeah. all i have to say for now man yeah. Uh, yeah, man. Shout out for the day. To survive, but I had a mind. Ran out of time. Now I lost the love of my life. I'm lost, I'm lost. Gotta find you. Touch down the first lesson. Yep, touch down the first lesson. Yeah, bro. Start as day because the old man, but you know the vibes. Yeah. Keep it moving. Yeah. Successful day in the office. Yeah, bro. Now we're gonna have a Zoom session. Yo, so right now, guys, we're on our way to Max's crib. Yeah. So, bro, when you first started this journey, bro, did you think like you were gonna get to a point where obviously you work for yourself, you don't go to school and all of that? Like, did you ever imagine this as the goal? I imagine I imagine this as the goal in terms of where am I in life yeah. and the position yeah but in terms of me and how I'm gonna get here no not so really like the steps were different I thought I was gonna be here yes regardless but via some other things oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah I always knew I'm gonna be here so the goal it's still there but the the the, the plan changed oh no I get yeah. that I get that the goal yeah I feel I feel like yeah in terms of like uh, now nah, in high school i knew i was gonna be because at first i wanted to be like a youtuber bro because okay. i was inspired by by that time like spizzy kane and quadeca oh yeah 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 legends know those people quadeca spizzy kane logan paul those 365 vlog days yeah um jake on those 365 vlog days as well like ksi everyone like i was inspired by them so i highly wanted to be a youtuber i started youtube i became like not that well known but like yeah, yeah you were pushing yeah. yeah i was pushing and then i just managed to stop and then the plan changed because of the virus i remember corona is the one that changed the, the, the whole thing because i was so limited i didn't have the resources to actually record inside the house because like oh. in a flat bro so like, yeah i can't shoot videos here bro so yeah the plan changed but the goal is still the same i still believe i'm where i wanted to be yeah yeah no, i get that i get that man so what how do you how do people have that mindset of like having a goal and actually trying to achieve it you know because a lot of people yeah. want to be rich a lot of people want to have money but how do you actually put in the work to get to that goal what would you say what advice would you give uh first just pray a lot bro read your bible that's something i was doing a lot right yeah uh, and secondly if you want to like I wouldn't say become rich or whatever, but whatever goal that you have, just like first pray about it and then it's hard, but ish, just be patient, bro. Like yeah. it will work, it will it will work out because there's a lot of the times where I actually push something and I expect this outcome, but I don't get it. Yeah. But then I push something whereby I'm not expecting the outcome, and then I get the outcome where I wanted previously. You see. Oh so yeah, yeah. The I actual get that. thing is to actually just work bro and in terms of results it's gonna hurt you a lot if you're expecting results like within your work rate if you're telling yourself one week yeah yeah i want to yeah, be yeah. a millionaire you're gonna hurt yourself more rather be like i have an, i want to have one week of just pushing yeah obviously you know bro working hard 
it always gives you a guarantee of, of profit or of wins or of success working yeah. hard in general but the tricky thing is time yeah um, not really real time, in time and patience when is your result that you put of putting in the work gonna come out so, yeah so for like for that phase it was difficult for me so for me what kept me moving is praying and just continue like falling in love with working hard yeah to the point where you don't even feel it as much but people can see that you're working hard but when people tell you you're like hey damn yeah I'm no, just, you don't even realize you don't even yeah know. it yeah, comes just, an everyday thing basically. yeah fall in love with working hard bro, like, yeah fall in love with the process yeah, not the love, destination yeah basically. not the destination yeah just fall in love with, just like with me right now like falling in love with everything that i do bro whether like i lose or i fail at least i know that i tried yeah. so it's better to try than not try at all see no that's too real man yeah. that's too real Okay, yeah, it's not a, it was not that confusing, I guess, for you because I can. And just like that, guys, we have reached the end of the video, man. Um, it was definitely a successful day. As you guys saw, Lincoln, um, we unwinded his mind, and you know, he gave us a lot of insight on everything, you know, how um where he came from, and just seeing how his lesson went. Also, you know, it's good to see that like he's empowering people and still. I guess living because now he's done for the day we're, gonna, we're just gonna be chilling now then yeah lincoln my brother do you want to yeah. say goodbye to the people yeah guys always remember to stay prayed up guys we're heading out right now gonna run some errands yes sir. so we're ending the day here for now but it's not gonna be the last time you see me guys especially sure. with my new car uh <laughs> my new car yeah. guys it's like superb Clutch is gonna be there it's gonna be a maza my is gonna be there supporting me as well yes, so yeah guys Always make sure to stay prayed up and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Thank you. What is going on guys? It's your boy Sasha Mashawa here and today I'm going to tell you about Pocket Brokers massive giveaway. Your trusted partner in financial ventures is celebrating their seventh birthday in style. And trust me, this is not a celebration you want to miss. With seven years of excellence, Pocket Broker is happy to announce their biggest giveaway yet with a prize pool worth a million dollars. Yes, you heard me correctly. A million dollars. This is not a giveaway you want to miss. They're not just handing out cash. They've got prizes that will seriously get your heart racing. So yeah guys, that's the giveaway that Pocket Broker is having right now. And all you have to do to be eligible to join is genuinely just trade. You know what I'm saying? So you're basically just getting awarded for trading. Be sure to use my promo code to get a whopping 60% bonus on your first deposit. Pocket Broker has a range of benefits that allow you to elevate your trading game and just overall learning experience, you know? So they're empowering your learning process. So be sure to check out their giveaway. Be sure to check out their platform. Be sure to use my promo code when you sign up to get a whopping 60% bonus on your first deposit. And as always, I'm rooting for you and I wish you all the best on your financial journey. Tambo!